Good morning everyone. So today we are getting this area planted up. So this one, two planters we're going to get planted up today and this front area here. Good morning birdies. Oops, a few of you guys have asked <clears throat> what kind of soil I have, and we're just going to go with sandy, <clears throat> excuse me, sandy soil. So most of the times I feel like I'm planting by the beach, it's like I'm by the beach side planting my plants because this is sandy soil. So sometimes you'll see me amend the soil with either garden soil, compost, or manure. Um, depending on what it is but I've planted in that soil directly without doing anything to it and the plants uh, depends on what kind of plant it is some plants are very forgiving they will grow in any type of soil so I'm just going to get these four in I'm actually trying to hurry because there's a thunderstorm coming so I'm trying to hurry and get these all in the ground and these are right in front of there so let's finish up so I'm just going to add some plantone. I ran out of my biotone. It is a biotone, but what was the other one called? Was it called biotone? The blue and white bag? Because it's biotone on it, but it says plantone. So we're going to go add it to all the holes. Dump it out. And the roots is a bit on the dry side so you see they were getting a bit dry because it wasn't getting enough water there's pretty dry so I'm gonna water it in well it's gonna be raining pretty hard so I may skip the watering process with my sand
you remember I was gonna put this in the um, pot. I changed my mind, I'm just gonna put it in the front. <laughs> Cause my pots are ready to fall. Can't fit that anymore. So I'm just coming in with some compost to put around them. Eventually I'm going to do the entire garden bed with compost. I'm just waiting for all these leaves to finish falling. Okay, so the compost is done and I think I have enough time to clean up before the rain starts coming down. So at least they're in the ground because they were just sitting by the wayside for like over a month now and they're drying out. So I have see them bounce back to life. Yes, I planted them in sand. <laughs> dying because I forgot about them. So I put them in the ground hoping they'll come back. And as you can see, it's been cold. So they have been struggling a bit. This one is doing well. So that one's coming in nicely. This one's coming in nicely, but this one has been struggling. So these two are called Snow Princess Lapillaria, and that's our Super Tuna Bordeaux. And over here in the planter pot, we have Super Tuna Priscilla, Mini Vista Violet Star, and Snowdrift. So I'll keep you guys updated on that. Thank you for watching, guys. Have a good one.